Hi guys, I'm Rick. Welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm making chicken teriyaki stir fry. Okay, I'm starting out here with a large skillet. I think it's like a 20 inch, 22 inch. I have oil in here, warming vegetable oil. I'm going to add in some partially defrosted chicken, boneless skinless chicken breast. And I'm going to brown these over medium heat. All right, I uh, went ahead and browned up my chicken. I added some salt and pepper to it also while I was frying. It still might be a little raw in the center, but that's all right. I'm uh, cutting it up into small cubes. I took all the chicken out of the pan and drained the grease off. And when I'm done cutting the chicken up, I'm gonna return it back into the pot. Okay, I finished uh, cutting up all my chicken. And uh, I used two large pieces of chicken and one medium-sized piece of chicken. I'm going to return it all back to the pan and let it continue cooking until it's cooked through. Okay, I allowed my chicken to cook over medium heat for about 10 minutes just so it got cooked through. I reach. And to that, I have two 16 ounce bites of uh, stir fry vegetables. This is Hong Kong blend. You can use any variety you like. I just happen to like the ingredients in this. So I'm going to add them in. I bought a third bag of uh, stir fried vegetables. I think I'm going to go ahead and add those in too. Alright, this is another 16 ounce bag of stir fried vegetables. This is a uh, deluxe, pretty much the same thing, a few different ingredients. If you want to get one big bag of vegetables, go ahead and get it. This is the best deal I found at the store. Now I'm going to put a lid on this and let this cook over medium heat for a few minutes to warm the vegetables through and start to soften them up a little bit. We don't want them too soft, but just a little soft will do just fine. All right, I left my chicken and stir fry vegetables cook over medium heat for about 10 minutes to thaw out the vegetables and warm them through. Now to this I'm going to add in a almost 12 ounce jar of Kikkoman's teriyaki glaze. I'm going to turn this down a little bit so this glaze doesn't burn. Let me add a little water to this bottle. But, uh, Okay, now I'm going to continue to cook this with the cover off because I don't want it to get sloppy and soggy. Give this a stir. All right, I left my chicken stir fry cook for about another 10 minutes to uh, cook the teriyaki through it and to reduce some of the sauce. Let's go ahead and plate some of this up. I made some rice earlier. Okay, there you have it. Chicken teriyaki stir fry served over rice. Give this a try. I think you'll like it. And until next time, I'll see you.